did you know Dubai are doing seriously amazing for the future? The UAE is no stranger to some mind-boggling and stunning architectural projects, in the last few years alone we've seen incredible arrivals such as the Louvre Abu Dhabi, in Dubai, Dubai Frame, and of course Expo 2020 Dubai. But there is plenty still to come. Recently opened the Museum of the Future in February 2022, we take a look at all the UAE projects we can still look forward to. In this video, I show the 11 upcoming UAE mega projects we can't wait for. Welcome back again to Sultan TV official amazing videos. Number 1 Mohammed bin Rashid Library Another attraction that we can't wait for, is the Mohammed bin Rashid Library should open its doors sometime later in 2022. Located in Al Jadaf, when complete the library will house more than 4.5 million books, including printed and e-books, and will also include several areas for events, activities, education, and cultural festivals, as well as venues for exhibitions, and a 500-seat lecture theater. The Mohammed bin Rashid Library will also host the main headquarters of the International Council for the Arabic Language and publish the Mohammed bin Rashid Contemporary Arabic Language Dictionary. Number 2 Atlantis The Royal The Royal Atlantis Resort and Residences is on track to open later this year. The 5.15 billion dirhams property will be made up of 231 luxury apartments, 693 hotel rooms, and 102 suites. The 43-story hotel will also feature 90 swimming pools, including a stunning rooftop infinity pool suspended 96 meters above the palm on level 22. Number 3 Made on 1 Dubai's ever-growing collection of new malls will be further enhanced with the opening of Made on 1. When it opens, the Made on 1 Mall in Mohammed bin Rashid City will be home to the world's longest indoor ski slope, a 1-kilometer slope in Made on 1 Mall's 12,000-square-meter winter village. The mall is also looking to snatch the title of the world's largest dancing fountain, with its record-breaking water feature measuring 25,800 square meters. However, construction seems to be in the early stages, so it's likely to be a while before we can check this one out. Number 4 1 Zabi L You might not know it by name, but you've certainly clocked the rise of 1 Zabi L, a duo of skyscrapers connected by the link, the world's longest cantilever. This architectural marvel will feature the typical roster of modern residences and high-end retail, but will also add a new one and only urban property, one, only one Zabiel. Also not to be missed is the link at one Zabiel, a panoramic sky concourse that will feature world-class restaurants, celebrity chef outlets, a statement swimming pool pictured above, wellness facilities, and entertainment. Number 5 Rixos Marina Abu Dhabi It's fair to say that the city has watched the giant pink arch of the Rixos Marina Abu Dhabi Hotel, formerly set to be a Fairmont property, rise with curiosity. It achieved architectural icon hood even prior to its launch, which was originally slated for 2020, but will finally arrive this year. Although there's no update on the official opening date, it's slated for the coming months, and the brand has already set up its Instagram page, although is yet to populate it with the sneak peeks of what we can expect. Number 6 Al Reem Mall Reem Mall has described itself as the world's first omnichannel mall, the details of what that actually means get complicated quickly, but from what we understand, the mall will offer a blended retail approach, which allows for digital shopping, through an app slash website, at the same time as conventional bricks and mortar mall shopping. Data from your shopping habits can be used to make sure you get invited to redeem tailored promotions. Milat Syra Burm and Digital Experience Manager for Reem Mall is on record as saying at Reem Mall, we are leading this transformation by creating a totally new retail concept, the world's first fully digitally enabled mall, supported by an integrated logistics hub. Number 7 Snow Abu Dhabi The enchanted forest-themed Snow Abu Dhabi is being trailed as the world's largest snow park and will open its doors in this year. The attraction will span a huge 125,000 square feet area, divided into distinct whimsical zones. We can look forward to themed characters and 13 thrilling rides and attractions, including an enchanted tree, a snowflake garden, a crystal carousel, a nice labyrinth tobogganing, and a shovelton moor. It doesn't matter if the weather outside is frightful. The park will be kept at a rosy-nosed minus 2 degrees Celsius, with a 500 mm covering of snow, more than enough for beefy snowball building, offering a year-round chill spot in this, our beloved land of the eternal sun. Number 8 Side National Museum once completed the Zayed National Museum will stand as an architectural marvel, a fitting home for the inspiring story of our great nation and its visionary founder. Located on Saadiyat Island, already the seat of so much cultural import, the breathtaking structure will include a 123-meter high tower. 
The main gallery will be devoted to a collection of artifacts illuminating aspects of Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nahyan, the man, and his leadership journey, the country's unification, and beyond. There will also be gallery space devoted to exhibitions on falconry and conservation, land and water, history and society, science and learning, faith and Islam, and it will host the Grand Sheikh Zayed Library. Work on the building began back in 2019, and it's thought that the museum will open sometime between 2023 and 2025. Number 9 Guggenheim Abu Dhabi Once finished, the Frank Gehry designed Guggenheim Museum will add a jagged smear of wow to the Sadiat Cultural District skyline. True to the spirit of Guggenheim, the plans for the building cut a contemporary, unconventional, but singularly beautiful design. One that contains nods to its host nation, like the funnel-shaped protrusions that occupy sections of the exterior, that were inspired by the region's historical wind towers. As outside, so within. Guggenheim Abu Dhabi will exhibit a collection of modern and contemporary art from some of the most important creatives of the 20th and 21st centuries. Galleries will surround the central atrium on four levels, connected by glass bridges providing over 13,000 square meters of exhibition space. It was confirmed last year that the Guggenheim Abu Dhabi will now open in 2025. Number 10 Anantara Mina Al Arab Raz Al Khaima while Raz Al Khaimah is not traditionally compared to the Honeymoon Island destination, it soon might be with the addition of Anantara Mina Al Arab. Now set to open in this year, this stunning Anantara Eco Resort will be located in the new Mina Al Arab district along the coast of Raz Al Khaimah. When it's complete, it will boast 306 guest rooms, suites, and a part that's really caught our eye, overwater villas, Maldivian style. There will also be an overwater restaurant serving Thai cuisine, as well as a seafood grill and a beach and pool bar. Number 11 Wynn Resorts Raz Al Khaima A slice of Las Vegas is headed to Raz Al Khaima as Wynn Resorts plans to open its first integrated resort in the MENA region in the Adventure Emirate. The multi-billion dollar resort will be developed on Marian Island and feature more than 1,000 rooms, world-class shopping, a state-of-the-art meeting, and convention facility, an exclusive spa, more than 10 restaurants and lounges, extensive entertainment choices, a gaming area, and other amenities. Those looking to feast on Wynn's lavish buffets, marvel at its live entertainment and shop its boutique stores will have a little while to wait, as the resort is only expected to welcome guests in 2026. I hope you will like this Sultan TV official video and share it with your friends. My heartfelt appreciation for your loving comments. We'll meet you in another amazing video.